Hey guys, Running Kimono here. I hope you're all doing great. Okay, today's video, we're going to talk about 90% clearance over at Walgreens, and there's a lot. And I know that these videos are like, how is there so much clearance? Well, lately, it's been like every day, it's been like Christmas over there. And for some of this stuff, it's amazing. It's meat and potato stuff for your household. So, I mean definitely walk down some of these aisles I'm describing because it's worth it. And um, a couple ground rules about clearance shopping. It's either found in the specific section on an end cap or in a specific clearance area in the store. So one of those three, it is always a year mileage may vary on the clearance and the cost where it might be at that time. Tuesday is always a really good day to go on the hunt because that's usually when these hard resets happen. And what might be happening here in Michigan might be completely different than in Florida or Michigan and Texas might be exactly the same, which it always is, which is weird. <laughs> and don't be shy to always ask a manager, be super nice. Um, sometimes they can give you um, the intel on when things are going to clear, especially if you smile and you're super nice. I mean, how can they resist? So um, just always play this one by ear and don't get discouraged that if you see like the huge bonanza up here and if you don't have that in your hometown, perhaps it's the same. Perhaps it'll happen next week. Perhaps it might never happen, but it's always, you, you're going to lose nothing by going out there and just at least looking and, and trying. And that's half of clearance shopping is that if you put a little bit of effort into it, you'll at least find one thing. And if I could get you guys to subscribe, hit the notification bell and like this video, I would be forever grateful. So many of you in the comments have been asking about pumpkin. I have not made a update video in the last many, many weeks. Um, so he went to Ohio. Um, part of his grievances with me was that the fact I wasn't going to make these Buckeye um, chocolate, you know, balls at like 10 o'clock at night or whatever hour of the night he wanted them. And cats shouldn't be eating them too. But he wanted them and that's why he packed up his stuff um, and went to Ohio. So he walked down there um, and he got a job apparently working construction doing drywall. He's been texting my husband photos of himself at work. But we were in a part of the UP um, a couple days ago, and we saw this signage for a fireworks um, company, and um, it was on a billboard, and that's clearly Pumpkin. So he's, I think he's working in the UP for this Mel's Fireworks, because um, that's clearly my cat. But it's still a mystery. If you guys might have seen him, please let me know in the comments. And as a cat parent, you know, this is just some disheartening info, and he's just doing this sort of stuff in the middle of a pandemic, in the middle of summer. So go figure. Okay, guys, so the first block of slides come from an Instagram friend, um, All The More Free. I'll leave her Instagram in the notes if you want to check her out. She always finds the best clearance. She lives closer to me, and she found the mother load of clearance, and um, so we're going to go through this. I know a lot of you were asking about the lip products, so these are specifically them, including this fancier lavender chapstick for 39 cents. So as you can see, it was originally $3.99, and that's a 90% drop right there. And this Blistec medical one uh, is 19 cents. It's called, uh, I have one of these actually on my desk. And they're just always great to have, you know, if you have really bad chapped lips or in the winter time, it's always great. 19 cents is a stock up price and it's called Lip Medex. There's also a generic Walgreens one that's either 12 or 14 cents, depending on your store. You might want to keep an eye out for that. And it has the Walgreens logo on it. And I think the flavors are like cherry and then just a plain one, but like 14 cents is a stock up price. Okay, so now we're looking at some cold sore medication. Uh, the original price is $16.99, so that stuff must be made out of gold or something like that. And it's down to $1.69, a sort of product that you want for your stockpile because you don't know when you'll have a, a cold store or you might need this and always check the expiry date too for these sort of medications. Now we have some Zycam $14.99 down to $1.49. So that is some really inexpensive cold medication and lots of the cold medication hit 90 in the last week at various stores throughout the U.S. We have the Walgreens cold and flu 749. I know I've hauled this one before in the past down to 74 cents. So if you don't like taking syrups, if pills are more your speed, I'm kind of a pill lady too. Um, this is definitely uh, a real good stock up price. And of course, check the expiry dates. You don't want to buy something that's been expired five months. And then we have the Walgreens brand. See how it looks like the Mucinex bottle? Like identical. <laughs> Just pointing that out. So it's $11.49 uh, down to $1.19. So that is really a steal of a deal right there. And now we have a um, container of the Sucrets 
Vapor Cherry. I think that's 28 lozenges. So it comes in that little tin. Like this video, if you remember the episode of Everybody Loves Raymond, where his brothers were going crazy about Marie hiding the secrets. I think that's like one of my favorite episodes ever with that series. But as you can see, it went from $5.99 down to $0.59. Cents. So that right there is some exceptional deep savings. And if you think about it, guys, um, everybody needs at least one cough drop per winter. So if you were going to stock up on some of this stuff, grab some for your family, in-laws, you know, uh, your parents, like this is such a great deal. This is $1.79 um, for the honey. It's like a generic cough drop down to $0.17. Cents. That is a stupendous price. And we have the eucalyptus oil for $4.99 down to $0.49. Cents. So that right there, some tremendous savings if you might need that to cure a cold. Now, um, special shout out to Texas Frugal Finds, another Instagrammer, another friend of mine. Um, I will leave her um, Instagram also in the notes if you want to go give her a follow along with all the more free. So anyhow, the TheraFlu on clearance for $1.69. In the August Big Book of Savings, there's a $3 coupon dropping that down to free. You will not get overage. So the um, IVC coupon will reduce down to $1.69. So no overage, no nothing, but just a quick little freebie. Um, I know that these were found in Michigan like about a month back, but since they've been cleared, but she's still finding them down there in Texas. So you might want to look for them as well. Um, it's just another little freebie with the August um, IVC big book of savings, those coupons. Now, for the last week or so, I've been talking about it. The top coupon is a $3 off of a Robitussin. Here in Michigan, um, where I'm living, it's either been like a dollar and some change or like 79 cents or 89 cents. So I found three different types. The first one was just a generic one for $1.89. You basically get the catcher to scan this. It'll drop down to free. So the $1.89 cost, it'll be taken off from that $3 IVC. So no overage, no nothing. And this is allowed at Walgreens. And you can do multiples per transaction. I wouldn't go more than 10 because it's cough medicine. And sometimes if you grab like a bunch, it just won't let you buy that many. You might have to break it up into a couple transactions, especially if you find a bunch. But I think the most I found was five at one store and I had no problem buying all five. This is a night one for 87 cents. So I'm finding a gamut of different ones from like regular, nighttime. And this next one is for um, severe, cough and sore throat for 79 cents. So um, just a whole bunch of them. This is the time to stock up on this sort of stuff when it's dirt cheap. Um, there's nothing better than a free cold medication. I mean, how great is that? Now we have some fancy honey. Um, this is not the best savings, but I know in some stores it hit 90. So it was $2 and 69 cents or $1.19. So you might want to look for that, especially if you use honey um, for cold or allergies or something like that. And these kids Hall's vitamin, I saw many of them at many stores. It was some goofy price, like $1.74, which is still way too much. Let's see how much this will drop in the next week or two. Maybe something to grab. Okay, let's talk about skincare now. A lot of the Walgreens brand, these little um, lotions that you put in your purse down to 79 cents from 99 cents. Over to the Aveeno, this is a 50% off, so um, $10.99 down to $5.49. I think there might be some digitals to accompany these, so you might want to scan them in the store to see if the coupons attach. Why not? And now we have the Neutrogena um, for $9.79. So a little bit of savings right there, still kind of expensive. I know there was a $3 coupon floating around. Perhaps it might attach to that. More skincare, including the Mederma, um, $37.99. That stuff is not cheap. Down to $18.99 and $43.99 down to $21.99. So that's 50% off. We have the CeraVe, again, 50% off at $8.99 and $5.49 for diabetic skincare. I should have grabbed these for my mom, but I wasn't thinking, so I, I might have to go back and look for them. We have the Curel. I think this guy was $5 and some change. Um, this was found in a regular clearance section. You might want to keep an eye out for that one. And then uh, the jo the Clean and Clear is down to $6.79, so a little bit of savings right there. And we have the Olay, the different serums, $26.99 down to $20.49. Still a little bit out of pocket. I would love to see it for $2.69. That would be a stock up price. Also in the skincare line, we have the Shea Moisture um, down to $4.89. That is still a lot of money out of pocket. Maybe it'll drop a bit more, but there was a lot of Shea Moisture products um, on clearance. So 
when is the 90% going to happen on skincare? I'm thinking pretty soon, according to these stickers. And don't forget to take a quick walk down um, a clearance end cap or section. Lots of minis for traveling um, have been reduced down. Not to the greatest or biggest savings, but hey, it's better than paying full price if some of the stuff you might uh, need. Or if you're traveling yourself and you want to grab a couple items, you know, it's better than paying full price. Now we're going to talk about something called the dollar spot. A lot of Walgreens have it. Usually it's in smaller markets where, you know, they don't have as many items. They have this dollar spot. So we have this little dish soap for a dollar and it's down to 49 cents. That's 50% off. So there's some savings right there. We have the Ajax um, laundry pods for 49 cents. So you're, you're not getting as many, but it's not full price. So that's the way of looking at it. We have some fabric softener for 79 cents. So not the biggest savings right there, but you know, maybe it'll drop even more. We have some, um, like a knockoff of the Febreze, um, fabric spray for 49 cents. We have some plates for 69 cents. So with this sort of stuff, when it hits 90, I think that's definitely going to be the day to pounce when everything's like about 10 cents. Wouldn't that be nice? We have these food storage bins for 59 cents. Even throw in some points or register rewards and grab a bunch of these items. You know, that might be the way to do it. We have some aluminum foil for also 69 cents. Okay, so also in that dollar spot, they have a lot of cleaner. So this is a little trigger spray for 79 cents. We have the Ajax for 59 cents. So that, you know, it's starting to get to be a better deal for us. Um, and maybe, you know, throw in some points and just get a bunch of stuff. That might be an option. And then we have this little floor cleaner by Dynamo for 79 cents. So a little bit of savings to clean your house um, with items from the dollar spot. The last couple of items are food, including the Crunch and Munch for 69 cents. That's a really yummy one. Always check expiry dates, too. You don't want to buy something that's expired last, you know, February. Uh, we have some fruit roll-ups also for 69 cents. That's some... I, I enjoy those too. I actually like everything here in clearance. I want it all to be a, a 10 cents for me. And then the um, Hello Panda for 69 cents, also a really great price point. So that's it for clearance, guys. Good luck with that. And if you missed it yesterday, I made a video. There's going to be an August candle sale next week over at Bath and Body Works where three wicks are rumored to be $11.95. Um, if you love aromatherapy and Bath and Body Works, this is a video you might want to check out. A lot of great information and I will link it here at the very end. As always, thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.